a brief history of genomics. Genomics is an interdisciplinary field which focuses on the structure, function, evolution and mapping of genomes. So we must first know what is meant by genome. Genome is an organism's complete set of genetic information. The genome contains all the information needed to build and maintain an organism. Genomics is a relatively new discipline. It is difficult to pinpoint a particular year of origin, but it could be said that it started in 1871 with Frederick Mischer identifying nuclein in the cell nucleus. In 1904, Walter Sutton and Theodore Bovary proposed the chromosomal theory of inheritance. Albrecht Cosell in 1910 discovered the five nucleotide bases, namely adenine, cytosine, guanine, thiamine, and uracil. 1926, Tom Roderick, a geneticist, coined the term genomics. In 1953, James Watson and Francis Crick discovered the double helix structure of DNA. In 1980, Frederick Sanger, Walter Gilbert and Paul Berg shared the Nobel Prize for pioneering DNA sequencing methods. The development of polymerase chain reaction by Carrie Mullis in 1983 led to the development of next generation sequencing techniques which made sequencing much faster, cheaper and easier and led to the boom in the field of genomics. Since the 1990s, thousands of genomes have been wholly or partially sequenced, starting with Haemophilus influenzae in 1995. In 1996, the genome of Saccharomyces cerevisiae was sequenced making it the first eukaryotic genome to be sequenced. The first multicellular organism to have its whole genome sequenced was the nematode Cynorhabditis elegans in 1998. In the year 2000, the genome of Arabidopsis thaliana, the model plant, was sequenced. In 2001, the Human Genome Project published a draft of the human genome. In 2002, the genome of house mouse was sequenced. In the same year, the genome of Anopheles gambiae, the principal vector of malaria, was also sequenced. In 2004, the genome of red jungle fowl was sequenced. The red jungle fowl is the direct ancestor of domestic chicken. In 2005, the whole genome sequencing of chimpanzee was completed making it the first non-human primate genome to be sequenced. In 2010, the genome of western clawed frog, Xenopus tropicalis, was sequenced. Xenopus is used as the model organism for early developmental studies. Another model organism, Danio rario, commonly known as the zebrafish, had its genome sequenced in 2013. A few agriculturally important crops to have their whole genomes sequenced are rice, maize, sorghum, soya bean, pigeon pea, foxtail millet, ain corn wheat, and chickpea. With the development of next generation sequencing technologies, the cost for whole genome sequencing has reduced radically while also providing higher throughput data. The NGS technologies have three major improvements compared to the first generation sequencing methods, them being they do not require bacterial cloning, library preparation is done in a cell-free system, millions of sequencing reactions are done parallelly, detection of bases are done cyclically and parallelly. Here is a list of few next generation sequencers.
I do hope that you've learned something new today. Do like, share and subscribe. And until next time, thanks for watching.